<laughs> o M G. That's right, what's up? All right. I don't believe the news that just broke. Oh, this is so fire. Oh, I'm about to burn up. This is so fire. Before we get to the news, give this video a big thumbs up. That's right. The like button's right around there, right here. Click it right below this video. Bro, Street Fighter V Championship Edition is heading to the Nintendo Switch. EB Games. This is a major gaming retailer for Canada. EB Games Canada has accidentally tweeted out the tweet. They said, and I quote, Street Fighter V Championship Edition is heading to Nintendo Switch. Pre-order now in store. This is coming directly from EB Canada's um, official Twitter account and so this pretty much confirms it now the tweet is still up at the time of the recording of this video I don't know if they're gonna take it down this would have been a major Nintendo Direct headline a way to start off the next Nintendo Direct somebody getting fired tonight oh shout out to the homie Day Day and our sponsor Discord chat for um, adding me, bro. <laughs> bro, this got me out of my bed. I was sleeping. <laughs> I was like, whoa. Bro, you do not understand. This is what I grew up on, bro. This is me, bro. Every day, bro, after school. Going to the laundry mat, dropping them quarter, putting the quarter down on the machine. I got next, bruh. I got next. Back up. Get out my way, little skinny Jamaican. And I used to wreck dudes in Street Fighter, bro. I used to be a beast in Street Fighter 2, bro. On the Sega Genesis, this is one of the reasons why I played my Sega Genesis just as much as my Super Nintendo. Street Fighter 2 Champion Edition. The gameplay on the Sega Genesis was better than the Super Nintendo version. And so I had this. It was, it was Street Fighter 2 Turbo Championship Edition. They used to have all those sub, subtitles. But bro, Street Fighter 5 Championship Edition has been announced by EB Games. I remember when EB Games was super popular in the US too. They got bought, bought out by GameStop. I was gonna buy up GameStop. But bro, this game heading to the Switch is huge. And what you see right here is more than likely how the Switch version is gonna run. Bro, case in point, Dragon Ball Fighters. I have fighters on the Xbox and the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> the Nintendo Switch version can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with all the other versions. Why? The cell shaded art style. Now, granted, Street Fighter V does look a little cleaner than um, fighters. But um, one thing that I loved about fighters was it was rock solid 60 frames per second on the Switch. I can almost guarantee the Nintendo Switch version of Street Fighter V Championship Edition is going to be 60 frames per second. Bruh, we got Mortal Kombat 11 that is not shell shaded, a graphically intense game running around or at 60 frames per second on the Switch. The gameplay is smooth. One thing I say for the Switch, it's a beast with RPGs. And 
It's a beast with fighting games. Bro, it has the granddaddy party platform. I mean, fighting game. Smash. Now we getting Street Fighter V. Bro, I'm going to be on this game every day on the Switch, bro. Who want that Street Fighter smoke? I'm talking all this trash. I haven't played Street Fighter V in like two years. So I'm probably garbage in the game. But I'm going to have a ball playing the game, bro. I'm going to master the ways of Akuma. Me Akuma Matata. What a wonderful phrase. I'm just so happy, bro. <laughs> Akuma Matata. Ain't no passing craze. It mean no worries for the rest of your days. It's a problem free philosophy. Akuma Matata. It's Akuna. But we got to get Akuma back on, on the Switch. Now, on the Switch, we do have... The old, we just been getting old ports, bro. And I, that's been my, I, well, I've been hot at Capcom, bro. That first they gave us Street Fighter to the final challengers. Gameplay, one thing about Street Fighter is the gameplay stands the test of time. And so I was still lit. I was still hyped for the final challengers. That's what I grew up on. So I was playing it. Then they gave us the 30th anniversary edition, which launched on all the other platforms. And so I was cool with that. Third Strike, a gem in the Street Fighter archives. We got to relive those Third Strike dreams. And so I was good. But bro, I've been telling dudes, give us a Street Fighter V game on the Switch. The art style, the Switch version would still look good and run good. The gameplay, you know it'll be at 60 frames per second. They have to maximize, optimize a fighting game. Dudes were telling me. The same dude who um, at me in my um, gaming Discord for sponsors, Day Day. He was the same dude I was telling, bro, I'm getting Street Fighter, the next Street Fighter. They need to make Street Fighter V on the Nintendo Switch. It was like that's not gonna happen it's a playstation exclusive but street fighter 5 when it launched on playstation i remember the game struggling to uh get sales um it was well it was bare bones too but they gradually added fighters the championship edition is gonna be so lit with all the new fighters um street fighter is the king of fighters in my opinion Always has been, always will be for me. This is the game that got me into fighting games. And so, my favorite fighting game are with my favorite gaming company. 2020 is going to be lit. This begs me to ask Nintendo. Um, Y'all need to announce this Nintendo Direct, bro. <laughs> the fact that this got announced today is the 25th. Could we be getting a Nintendo Direct within the next week? Sometimes when retailers accidentally list a major game. I remember when the Overwatch leaks were coming out. Boom. We got a Nintendo Direct um, days later. Um, and Overwatch was the leading game. This could be the leading game for the next Nintendo Direct. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about Street Fighter V Championship Edition announced for the Nintendo Switch? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out, boy. You're still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I got to hook you up. That's right. We're having monthly giveaways. $60 eShop codes for your Nintendo Switch. You can choose any game of your choice. How do you enter? One, subscribe. Make sure you're subscribed to this fire. Two, make sure you're following me on Twitter at obi one Place, And that's it. You're in for our monthly giveaways. But that's not it. It gets even better. Do you want to game with your boy every day? Do you want to join our private Nintendo Switch gaming Discord? Become a member. Three ways to join. One, through YouTube. There's a join button right below this video. It's two, through Twitch. Twitch Prime. You can do it for free or to subscribe through Twitch. And number three, the third way to join, patreon.com 
backslash obi one place you'll thank me later also check out the swag bro links are in the description see you later peace